Remember somebody talking about how Giannis was going to dunk his way through the playoffs and yada, yada, yada. Listen, this man is right now, he's the most overrated in basketball. Is he a good basketball player? Man, I love him. I love him. I like Whoa. him. I'm I sick. like what he's I'm sick. You are a hater. He says, you go from hating on Kawhi absolutely. to hating on Giannis. Giannis isn't overrated. He's absolutely Please overrated. Proceed. Okay, Tell me okay, how he's overrated. Okay. You guys put this man essentially in the NBA Finals this year. 60, whatever win he season. He went to the conference finals. Balled out. Yeah. Balled out. You put, Two no, wins you, away from no, the finals. Hold it, chill. MVP of the you league, most likely. You put him in the NBA Finals. He did not make it there. Not just did he not make it, he grossly underachieved. Grossly. The man, oh, as far as individual matchups as we brought up, shot 29%. When actually guarded by a formidable so uh, defender. You're, you're smarter than this. Hold you on, know that on. you know that it was not one on one. Because I turned to you, you said, What might we talk about? And I said, We might talk about Giannis, and we might talk about Impossible being the MVP, and you had a reaction I was not expecting at all. Please share. <laughs> He's not the MVP. To me, uh, when you talk MVP, that means you're the most valuable player on the team. Your impact is the largest. And when I watch Giannis, yes, he rebounds, he blocks shots, he defends, he does all those little things. I love what he does, I love him. But he's not going to close out a game for you. He's not going to go out and win that big game. In fact, in the fourth quarters, he turns into more of a center and more of into a roller to the rim rather than a guy with the ball in his hands creating opportunities for others. Giannis being my MVP right now, I have Kawhi Leonard being my MVP right now for what he's been able to do with Toronto. The fact that he can come into that system and not miss a beat and to be that player for this team. Now, is he a closer? Stop it. Ryan yeah. Hollins, yeah. you're telling me no. Kawhi Leonard is no. not. Kawhi's I think, I think Kawhi's maybe more. I think maybe you forgot. Hey. I no. think maybe you got hit in the head <laughs> and you forgot the fact that Kawhi Leonard is a top two player in this league and he I has like, Toronto I'm right not. back where they should belong. Talk about the MVP, which is an individual award, not a team award. And by the way, his team is having success also in the tougher Western Conference where there are no nights off. I don't know how you don't unanimously give the award to James Harden. Harden is a capable defender. Capable. Does he have hold capable. Let me, let me correct. Is, oh, no, Does stop. he have the impact? Stop. He doesn't stop. have stop. the stop. impact stop. Of, of Giannis. Please, please, stop. 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 It's not the most improved on defense award. It's not the most capable on defense award. <laughs> it's the most valuable player in the NBA award. And to compare James Harden's defense to Giannis onto the Kupos, please, no, man. No, I didn't want you to this dismiss is where it because you you're dismissing stop. it. Stop. 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 Giannis is the MVP. Unless you believe that half of the floor does not matter. Basketball. This, this should be easy to do. Who's better, Chris Paul or Chris Middleton? I take Middleton. Oh, man. I take Middleton you right now. Where you right now, in. I take Chris Middleton oh, right now. It's, it's not fun if you're going to be dishonest. Like, we can't, we can't have a conversation if you're going to be dishonest. Would it make any Guys, is Giannis the NBA's MVP right now? No. He's not. How he's not. He's not. The, listen, let, let, let me establish this because everybody's losing their mind. Okay. What was, uh, the, what was the premise? You said he's not in the top five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll put him in considerations. He's a stat stuffer. He's having an excellent year. Milwaukee's doing good. But listen, you got to be able to close games. And what do I mean in close games? We're talking about the best of the best. The MVP award, it's a lifetime achievement award. And some guys, they have to have three and four great seasons before they even get considered for the MVP. And if you look at the race right now, this is Giannis's first time blowing up. And you say as a closer, the ball's not in his hands. That stuff in versus importance, like I said, Anthony Davis has been averaging about 28 uh, 14 to 15. Where are the Pelicans the right now, Ryan? As a career. Where are the no, Pelicans no. right now? Hey, Why you keep Woody. going out, Anthony Woody. Davis? Because I'm talking about, where, talking where, about this year. Where are, they, where are they sitting at in the West? Now listen, I'm not where are they sitting in the West? Like the Why you keep throwing out Anthony Davis because, right no, now? I talk Who is going to be the X Factor in the West? Hands down, Russell Westbrook. Why do I say that? Russell Westbrook has the talent to win the NBA championship. He has the talent to beat the Golden State Warriors. That's how talented he is. But the one thing Russell Westbrook has to do He's got to be efficient from the three-point line. He's got to run his team. He's got to read coverages, make the right play, time in and time out. And in the fourth quarter, they have to run some symbol of offense. We might have massive disagreement. You, you believe that <laughs> Russ is such an X factor, <laughs> yeah. such an X factor, <laughs> Don't that his it. performance Don't can carry it. the thunder over the Warriors. Oh, he said it again. Absolutely. <laughs> there's, there's nobody on the Warriors 
that can stop Russ if he has his oh. mind to it. But that's part of Russ's biggest problem is that when he gets in his own way, he forgets everybody else on the floor. Ryan, top seeded Bucks, they take in the East? <laughs> no, man, are you kidding me? The Bucks are not going to make it out the second round. They got to see the Boston Celtics in the second round. Do you understand that? When you look at Giannis, I love him. MVP candidate, I get it. Amazing season. He's going to struggle in the playoffs to finish in the fourth quarters. Physicality and athleticism is not going to be enough. We just raved about Luka Doncic. Why? Because he can shoot a deep three and finish from the outside. That's how you finish games out. Collectively, good group. They defend. They play hard. Great story. They're not beating the Celtics.